big cities are dealing with smash and grab robberies. A record number of police officers have been shot and killed this year. What is President Biden going to do about all this lawlessness? Well, uh, Peter, I would say that, one, the president proposed uh, additional funding in his budget. Uh, over the funding that had been proposed by the prior president to increase and support local uh, local police uh, departments, make sure we keep cops on the beat, uh, and we ensure that local communities are working in partnership to crack down on, on crime uh, and any dangers they see in their community. So that's one of the steps. We've also uh, worked with a range of communities across the country on strike forces. As you know, something we've talked about in the past, we're continuing to implement that from the Department of Justice. But the President absolutely believes that uh, community police forces uh, can have an important instrumental effect in uh, helping keep communities safe. And does the President still think that crime is up because of the pandemic? I think uh, many people have conveyed that, and also one of the reasons that crime, one of the root reasons crime, we've uh, root causes of crime in communities is guns and gun violence, and we've seen that statistically around the country. Right, to your point, so when a huge group of criminals organizes themselves and they want to go loot a store, a CVS, a Nordstrom, a Home Depot, until the shelves are clean, you think that's because of the pandemic? I think a root cause in a lot of communities is the pandemic. Yes, go ahead. I wanted to follow up on some of Alex's questions.